In today's video, I'm gonna walk you through a troubleshooting technique for why you may not be able to place a room tag. For this example, we have a two-story kind of office building. If I go over to the second level on the right side of the screen, if you go up the stairs and you're in this hall, it's kind of a low wall and you're looking down into the first level common area. Let's say, for example, I would like to call out the first level rooms on the second level room here. So if I go to my architecture tab, activate my room command, and I hover over the space, it is wanting me to place a, an entirely new room, which is not what I want to do. I want to pick up these rooms that are already on the first level. So let's look at the reason why here. If I go over to my first level and I click on the X of the room and I go look at my properties palette under the constraints, this is telling me that it's on level one and the upper limit is 10 feet and we have no base offset and we have no limit offset. So my level two starts at 12 feet. So that is why it is not picking up my room on the second level because the room only goes to 10 feet. So how can we fix this? Two ways. You can click on the X and you can do a limit offset of say for example, 10 feet. Um, or you can change the level of the upper limit. Uh, I want to make this 22. You'll see when I change the constraints, it's automatically showing up here on my second level and the color fill is also showing up. So another way to change these constraints, if you go to a section view and you can find the rooms in your section view and simply grab the grips and drag them up. One thing I like to use pretty often that might help you out and make this a little bit quicker is to enable temporary view properties. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna to go to visibility graphics, go to the room category, expand it, and turn on interior fill and reference. And when I do that, I can see all my rooms and it, it just makes it a little bit quicker to grab them and to drag them up. And when you're done doing that, you can simply restore view properties and you're back to what the view originally looked like. And everything's showing up except for this one area here. So I'll just go back and see if I can grab that real quick and change the upper height. So now that I have fixed all my rooms to have to go up to the second level. Now I can simply tag my rooms. A better way to do that would be to go to the annotate tab, tag all, select room tag, and then select the tag that you want. And hit apply. And there they are. And there you have it. Thanks for watching.